tell if this is a new video from the new <laughs> uh, I'm filming this at six in the evening, which is unusual, but that's because I've got stuff on to do. So here is potentially two films. I think these are in the packages. I've been hitting it quite hard on eBay recently. One is my new phone. This is why I don't film during the day. Okay. One is my new phone. One is my first ever phone. So I thought I'd do a type unboxing. So now we have to use iBoldly, Jerry Rig, everything that we have. Mm -hmm. And at the moment, keep your opinions to yourself. There was a beard mess up. And I went with it, okay? <laughs> I got this but this phone came out in 1998. This was my first ever phone. This is the one that started all. In 1999. And it was on the phone. And it actually came with some of the paperwork. Now this phone actually has a phone number in it. One of the first still works. This phone was atrocious. <laughs> Absolutely atrocious. This is one of those ones where T9 didn't exist yet. So you had to push each button. Now, unlike a lot of phones at the time, if you needed N, you could just hold, you just go, you know, <laughs> you can just click it. So it'll be quickly twice that N. You know, if you need O, 444. Four, four. It's not mine. You have to, not this one, you had to hold the button down. So you'd hold it up to a second. So you, so you need C, you have to go A, B, C, A, space. And uh, it took a long time to send messages, which only really kind of flirt with a woman. And then you get a text message, you're like, shit, what did you say? And then you go out and it says, hurry up and reply. And it doesn't save drafts, and you have to go back to. Oh. <laughs> well, that's not promising, is it? So this phone is 25 years old, 22 years old, and it's in remarkable condition. So this is the size of the brick it comes with, with the proprietary. This is the phone. Now I said untested, which probably means broken. This is what it looks like. But look, that condition. And it's a chunker, but it doesn't feel like a chunker compared to the phone I'm filming on, which is the Galaxy S21 Ultra. But like the classic, but look how horribly designed that is. So this is the exact one. So I wonder if it turns on. Doesn't look like it's going to. I might see if there's a way to. That's not promising, is it? I'm going to see if there's a way to fix this. Maybe a new battery. Made in France. Uses for solar charger. Point nine nine. This is just in remarkable condition. Remarkable. It's the mustache. It's making me talk like that. I really hope this works or something. I don't know if 
It's about a charger in the moment. Oh yes, I do. It's right next to me. It's just right next to me. You can hear my cat's going crazy because it's at dinner time, but they've been noisy. They've been annoying, so we make them wait. Lights up. It actually lights up. Holy shit. Okay. On to the next one. This is my new phone. Now this phone is very similar to this phone. Oh. It doesn't light up enough. Very similar to this phone in many ways, and I've just doxed it myself. more hipster, oh my god, 2G phone, moustache, I do need to shave, no idea, so it's very simple, it makes me worry because this is, <laughs> this phone is like 350 quid brand new, which is insane what it is when you can just pick up like a Nokia 3310 for 20 quid, but you know me, it has to be interesting if I'm going to use it, so Let's see what's in it. Before, so this is the phone itself, which actually it looks like a calculator. And it's ooh, it's got basic functions so it can be used as all it can do is text, phone. You can use pigeon, like a, what is it, tele, telegram? I think there's that kind of um, messaging thing, which for some reason you can use on here. But this is far higher quality than I thought it was going to be. It was made by a Swedish firm, Swedish, because of course. And now, hang on, for the thumbnail. Uses, it can be used as a 4G hotspot. So, and it runs by, that is USB C in it. Bit of a USB C. Yes, USB C. Interesting. Now, in here, we also have well, the presentation box. This is Blackberry for protection apparently, but that makes me think, is this going to work? Because Blackberry no longer have a phone division at all, do they? That's boring. They still have software stuff, but I don't know if they're still doing... Yeah, USB-C can be. But it actually comes with a charger. I was not expecting. design philosophy behind this. Wish that car would be quiet. But that, how do we turn them on? So it runs like a version of Android-ish. And it's got Bluetooth on it, but it can't play any music. Which is the one downside to it for me, actually. 
but I've got an MP3 player for that now, so. Just really simple. I'm really looking forward to using this. I'm still gonna have this phone in general because there are people that can have a fiber or WhatsApp, but it won't be on me all the time. And I'm a hipster as fuck, don't worry about it. <laughs> but um, yeah, this is the first new video for me in quite a while. An unboxing I'm in there. Um, Uh, I'm trying, there we go, Blackberry Secure. Like I said, I'm trying to give up booze at the moment. I'm on four days, but I'll do a video about that. So if anyone's interested, like, subscribe, all that bollocks. Um, exactly what we thought it was. <laughs> Still got some interesting ones this way. We've got this 100 quid, so I'm alright with that. Right. Let's line up at the time. I'll see you later.